She's had an amazing me meditation experience here on this hillside by the castle. With all these steamians. How's that for a beautiful spot? Amazing. Yeah, Feeling nice and chilled. I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. Tomorrow. I should be on that. We share, share the group photos. photo. Just heading into the old part of town. I haven't been here before. This is incredible. Old buildings and churches and trams and this is just what a place. Check this out. Beautiful, beautiful. So it turns out it's 100 years anniversary today of Polish independence, which I guess makes sense because it's the 11th of the 11th. But there's big street parties, the sun is shining. It's amazing, absolutely amazing. Catch up. Yeah, so this is much, much more crowded than I guess. Good. That was a Crazy. bad idea to go here. <laughs> we want Captain Bob has for his, his lunch. No more burgers now. Yes, there is no such thing as a proper pie. What's it called? It's called Bigos. Bigos. Bigos, yes. Neo recommended, so. Here we are just chilling down by the river. Just had a lovely lunch. And just walking around the city, it's amazing. So much going on today for Independence Day. Parades and music and costumes. It's been a fantastic day. Check out this sunset just behind the captain there. It's beautiful. Look at Absolutely that. beautiful. Wish you were here, everybody. Here we are, just going in the salt mines. Yeah, how about that? That's yeah. awesome, huh? There's Katrina. Isn't she awesome? <laughs> Check out her channel, her music is fantastic. Wow. Check it out. This guy. <laughs> Heading down into the mines. Floor 53, we've come down from the top. Yay. And we've just hit the bottom. We've been walking downstairs for about 20 minutes. Here we are. Down in the church in the salt mines is one of the most incredible things I've ever seen. It's unbelievable this place. Well, we're not sure. We think it's Sherry, Sherry baby. <laughs> Might be Sherry. I don't I know. Think. I don't know. Sherry. Whatever it is, get it down your neck. <laughs> What's that? Get it down your neck. Ah. <laughs> get it down. Chug, 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 chug. <laughs> Tasty. <laughs> Here's Priscilla. Hello. Sorting out her, hey. her rats. Oh, 
<laughs> they're having so much. I can't keep. I can't keep up with them. It's like I'm so wasted because they kind of enjoy the nightlife, and I, you know, I'm I'm already too for that. But I have to go along with them and take care of them. And whew, they like, you know, it's so intense for them. You know, they love holidays and such. But too much alcohol for the, for the rats already. Yeah. Yeah. Check out the tables. Amazing. 327 meters below. It's bonkers. And the problem is it will be the final open bar. And we all go there for the last drink. And I see you there over there. Okay guys? Scary lift ride up to the top, jammed in like sardines we were, but it was way better than climbing all those stairs, let me tell you. Just come out the salt mines, followed all the guys. They knew not where they went, it was the wrong way, so now we're heading back to the salt mines, because we're lemmings. We just followed the crowd. Don't follow the herd, please. It's not the right thing to do. Don't follow the herd, follow your heart. And with that said, be strong, stay strong. Or whatever it is, D News says. <laughs> D News. <laughs> Selfish. Uh, we're Selfish. Off. I don't know how, I don't know how many ugly selfies are there so far. I don't care anymore. No, no, no. As long as we are in the selfies, it's not going to be ugly. So yeah. don't worry. It's dark. That's why. That is good. That is good. Dark is good. <laughs> At this time of the day, dark is already very good. End of the night, drinks at Cubis. Cam, found his selfie stick. Yeah, boy. I can't believe it. No. <laughs> so, um, we do a lot of bicycling and we, we keep talking about when we're, when we're biking in the cold, we're like, why in the hell don't we have a flask for some bourbon or Irish whiskey or whatever? And so, uh, last year, it just so happens, I'm here in Krakow, it happens that I know a family from Krakow. And, and, the, and the guy, he graduated, my oldest son, his name is Alex, to me. Hey Alex, if you're listening, throwing you under the bus too. So, uh, he comes to, to Poland every summer to take care of his ailing grandparents. And he goes to soccer uh, functions and things, and he told me, he said, I can get you a couple of old German flags. Nice. So I gave him some money. He gave him some money, and he came back empty-handed. I needed two flasks. I gave him money. Didn't get it. So uh, I forget. I'm a forgiving guy. So I forgave Alex. He's a good kid. But anyway, we was, we learned we were coming to Krakow. Decided I needed to get a flask, at least one. Uh, I was looking the other day when I when I bought my wife some earrings. I also was looking for a flask, and I found a flask. It's enormous. It's an old beat-up flask with a picture of a horse on it. It's huge. It's huge. Um, but I only could find one. It's in an antique shop. And the guy and I wasn't really communi weren't communicating because he didn't speak any English, and I don't know Polish. Um, I figure I got a discount. The sticker said 25. He gave it to me for 20. Nice. Now I've got a big giant flask. 20 zloty. Yeah. But metal, metal, yeah, yeah. So that was like five bucks American. Yeah, and over there it's a little bit more. And this one I figure has a story, a story I'll never know. But it's a big flask, so now I figure I'll just carry enough for both of us on our paper trips. <coughs> Good story. That's it.